Hey friends, do you need to make videos fast, fast free and on the go for your business or any other purpose? But you just don't know where to start? Well, I have a solution for you. I'll show you how to make videos the smart and easy way with your mobile. In my last videos, I demonstrate on how to use in video using the desktop or laptop. In today's episode, I'm going to cover the in video filmer app and I'm going to show you all the features and tips of using this app and make a snazzy video. Let's jump right in. For this tutorial, I'll be demonstrating this demo using my pro account of this app using my smartphone. Do give this episode a like and subscribe to our channel. Once you have downloaded the app, you can use the same account details as the in-video software on your desktop. If you do not have an InVideo account, you can create one for free which allows you to use the basic features. If you subscribe with a paid plan or the pro version, the Filmer app will unlock the additional filters, effects, transitions, and textiles for your use. If you are looking to upgrade, there's various payment options from as low as $2 per week or $15 per month. Click on the link below on the description box to enjoy the discount. To start, you can input your video clips from the mobile's video gallery or shoot the clips directly. If you choose to ship the clips using the app, you can choose to do in different modes, fast, slow, normal or loop. Once the video clips are imported, you will see the imported clips on the vertical timeline. This is the cool feature that is available on in Video Filmer app that is built for a mobile phone screen. You can reorder the clips or even edit the clip blocks by dragging it. Another cool feature is the different formats for your video. You can choose the vertical format for TikTok or Instagram stories or even set the horizontal format for YouTube videos. This is a great feature to help you publish to the preferred social media channels of your choice. If you find the videos are not in the right format, there will be a black canvas surrounding the video clip. By zooming in, you can make the clips bigger or make it fit on the platform where it will be published. When you set the clips in place, let's start editing. If you hover on the left to the three dots in circle, you can apply interesting effects or add filters. You can adjust the brightness, contrast or sharpen the clip if you do not want any clip you can choose the timeline block and select delete. Another cool feature is the transition where you can choose a fade option to make a seamless display or to the next clip. You can include royalty free music to your clips using the music library feature or choose license strike from iTunes. If you want a narrative video, you can add a voiceover to your video by clicking the red button to record your voice. That's not all. You can choose to add text for your clips by adding intro or captions. Just type the text to any parts of the video. Choose any font styles, colors or gradients to make the preferred selection. If you plan to use videos for your brand or business, it is recommended to use original clips and even licensed music. This will save you from copyright infringement and liabilities. Lastly, you can save the video locally or publish directly on your social media channels. It covers most of the options like IG Reels, Stories, and TikTok. When publishing as a video, choose the right resolution, such as the standard 1080 pixels and 30 frames per second. Alternatively, you can export it as a GIF. However, you need a pro account to enable this feature. You can choose to save the video on your mobile if you don't have a subscription. And with that, you know how to use the features of InVideo Filmer app and create videos on the go. Hey friends, I hope you enjoyed today's tutorial. If you find value in this content, make sure you give us a like or thumbs up. 
For as low as $15, you can enjoy the full features of InVideo. Make sure you use the discount code on the description code below. Subscribe to my channel if you have not. Activate the notification bell and I'll see you next time.